Now let's move on to Aaron Rodgers. And a lot of people were saying that was the last dance. Aaron Rodgers could be leaving. Do you believe Denver is the destination? A lot of people are saying this. Are you convinced the Denver Broncos is going to be the team Aaron Rodgers plays for next season? It depends, right? Because we could be looking at a similar situation to when Manning went to the Broncos or when Brady went to the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, right? But at the same time, it kind of depends on what Aaron Rodgers is looking for. I think at this point, he has all the individual success that he could ever have dreamed of, right? And But even with him being a transcendent quarterback in NFL history, he still only has one Super Bowl win. So if he feels like he needs more Super Bowl wins to cement his legacy, I don't know if Denver's the ideal destination purely because of going to the AFC. And I, in my personal opinion, I think the quality of the AFC teams is way stronger than the NFC teams, in my okay. in my honest opinion. And that division especially, I mean, you're dealing with Derek Carr and the Raiders, who they're always going to compete every game and give you a tough fight. You have the Chargers with Justin Herbert, who many people consider to be one of the next up-and-coming great quarterbacks. And then you have the Chiefs with Mahomes. And that's just in that division alone. We're not even talking about guys like Lamar Jackson, Joe Burrow, Josh Allen, and the Bills. So the level of competition in the AFC is pretty strong right now to where I could see that being a deterrent to Aaron Rodgers and saying, hey, Green Bay is the ideal destination. I mean, the only other quarterbacks I'm really competing with in the NFC are Brady and what, Kyler and Matthew Stafford, I guess. So it kind of depends on what it is that Aaron Rodgers is looking for. And Aaron Rodgers is a little bit of an aloof kind of an eccentric guy to where it's really hard to get a feel for what it is that he wants. But I, I could also still see him staying in Green Bay. I don't know what they would do with Jordan Love then, but that's just kind of my honest take. Absolutely. I Look, even though Nathaniel Hatchett, or I like to call him Nathan Hatchett, is going to Denver, I think that increases their chances. But I, I agree with you. I still think Green Bay – even though there's been all this hoopla over the last couple of years, I do believe Green Bay is the favorite. There's other teams out there too. Maybe Pittsburgh. You got a Mike Tomlin who's a who's a known winner, won a championship. Maybe Aaron Rodgers looks at him and says, "Hey, I could win over there." Maybe there's some dark horse teams out there too, like New Orleans. Even though they just lost their coach, their cap is crazy. But at the end of the day who knows how the cap works because some teams know how to maneuver other teams don't but back to the point I do believe that Green Bay is the favorite to keep Aaron Rodgers but I think Denver has increased their chances but who's to say that Hatchet and Aaron Rodgers have such a great relationship just because he was his OC that doesn't mean he has a great relationship with him maybe on the low he wants to leave that's the thing about the media and people got to understand just because the narrative is made up and people feel some type of way, especially that Aaron Rodgers is basically anti-vax and he's questioned Joe Biden. So some people feel some type of way about him and maybe stories are made up in certain ways. I still believe Green Bay is the favorite. I wouldn't be surprised if he goes to Denver, Pittsburgh, teams like that. There's dark horse teams out here too, like Seattle. Maybe that'll get them back in the picture if they're willing to get rid of a Russell, what Russell, I said Westbrook, Wilson. We'll see. But I, I'm not convinced that Denver is, whoa, they get Aaron Rodgers. They're going to the Super Bowl automatically like that. His best chance might, to win might just be with Green Bay. And they just have to figure out a couple things, tweak a couple things, see if maybe add a player or two, bring in another receiver. There's receivers out there that would be love to play with the great Aaron Rodgers. To me, I thought they were going to go to the Super Bowl this year. But but maybe next year is the year. Matt LaFleur, would you rather play for him or a guy in Nathaniel Hatchett who never been a head coach before? At least LaFleur, look at his track record. NFC Championship game, NFC Championship game, divisional round. Yes, it's been a disappointment because of the type of teams he's had. But look, he he he's known to get to the playoffs. A couple games, a game from the Super Bowl the first two years and two games the second year. So we'll see what happens. Yeah. 